everybody and welcome to another episode of Down the Fairway. In today's episode of Down the Fairway, I'm going to be giving you my number one tip on how to improve your sidearm accuracy. So let's get right into it. In my opinion, the number one thing to improve sidearm accuracy is to make sure you're putting enough spin on the disc. I see a lot of people having this problem to where they throw the disc, it comes off with a lot of wobble, and their accuracy then declines. So today we're going to be going into how to put more spin on the disc with your sidearm, which then will get you a better release point in the long run, and in turn be more accurate with the sidearm. I'm going to give you a couple drills to make sure that we're doing this properly. Get your disc put it in the sidearm grip and throw it 20 feet and once you throw it 20 feet which I will give you an example of right now once you can put enough rotations on the disc to make it spin like that kind of right in front of you then you can add it to your full stroke Watch how I extend at the end of my stroke and then I put that same kind of release or spin at the end of the throw which then propels it forward. I'm only focusing on one thing right there and that is putting as many rotations on the disc as possible. Now what this is going to do is it's actually going to get my fingers in front of the rest of my stroke. I have to keep my fingers in front of the stroke which will then put more rotations on the disc. And what this ends up looking like is this before and after. As you can see with the first sidearm, it came out with a lot of wobble. I didn't get the rotations that I needed on these putters. Now I suggest using the putters first when learning a sidearm or learning to put more spin on the sidearm because it really gives you a good indication of how you're doing. There's a lot of discs that are made these days that have such stability, they're able to hide what you're doing wrong. Using a putter and getting the wobble out of the putter will show you exactly how many rotations if you're putting enough rotations on the disc. That's it for this episode of Down the Fairway. Please remember to comment in the section below, like and subscribe, and as always, I'll see you down the fairway. Page two.